Well, glory to God would be my first, you know, my first statement is just, you know, we, we got to Jesus. We made much of him. No excuses. You, you, you know, you come to FCA camp, you can't leave without knowing about Jesus and the gospel and how to be saved. And um, so that was just really evident, you know, that Jesus was leaving them with nowhere else to go except to him and go to the cross. And Jesus knows all about us. He knows, you know, where we're at, where we're going. And he wants to save us from our sins, give us eternal life in our hearts, and give us eternal life as a destination as well. So it was a powerful night, man, just unbelievable. And uh, just really praising God for all the decisions. You know, there's just so many of them. And so that's a God thing. So just as the huddles, the huddles tonight, and just as you're going to bed, uh, just, just enjoy the Lord. Just enjoy Him. You, you've made it through camp physically. You, you've gotten better at your sport. You're tired. But it's a great tired. It's a great kind of tired. And you, you've made decisions for Jesus that will hopefully last for the rest of your life. Get in the Word. Grow in grace. And don't look back. You know, don't look back. Jesus says something about that in Luke 9. I think it's like 62. Whoever, you know, puts his hand to the plow and looks back is not fit for the kingdom of heaven. So it's, it's really a time just to go for it. You, you've made this decision for Jesus. Now go for it the rest of your life. Well, and a lot of kids brought a lot of baggage. You know, there were some oh, heart wrenching stories, weren't there? Yeah, unbelievable. And so the stories that were shared tonight, even, are just beyond maybe what you would think out of high school settings, and and they just blew us all away. And so I think that really set the tone too for what Jesus can do in the midst of what seems like a very desperate and hopeless situation. And man, Jesus can turn your life around, no matter where you're at, and no matter where you find yourself. It's the hope of Christ. Uh, to save people from their sins and then restore their lives. So it's awesome.